Okay, good evening, everyone. Uh, Yannick, uh, longest match in tournament history, three hours, 21 minutes. Your 10th meeting with Carlos, just a sensational match and uh, great effort out there. Just talk about the match, please. Yes, okay. Yeah, uh, it's always nice to be part of this kind of matches. You know, um, obviously disappointed that it didn't go my way, but, uh, you know, this kind of matches can, can really go both ways. Um, today was not my day. He, he played better in important moments, and, and, you know, that's it. But I'm, I'm, I'm proud again of, of, of a great week, um, you know, making finals here. Last year I won here, so it's for sure a place where I love to play and um, and yeah so I'm already looking forward for next year. Let's open it up for questions in the front row here. Hi Yannick, absolutely great match tonight. Um, you've played, despite the result tonight, you've played a fantastic tournament. What positives will you take from this match in this tournament in general as you head into Shanghai next week? Yeah, uh, Shanghai is completely different because the, the, the situation is, is, is different. So hopefully, you know, we I get into rhythm quite quite fast. Um, for sure, it's going to be a tough first round match. You know, every tournament is, is, is difficult to play first rounds. And, and uh, you know, this week it, it has, has gone, you know, growing, uh, you know, starting off uh, in one way and finishing off in a, in a different way. For sure, there are things where where I can improve, and and, and we will work on that. Um, you know, trying trying to become always a better player, and and, and also a better person. You know, so it's it's you know the work never stops, and and yeah, I think that's that's really it. No, uh, you know, today uh, you know the, all three sets they were you know very tough physically. You know, it was a long match, so. Um, Felt like the third set was decided by very, very little points, small points, and um, they went his way. So it's all good. In the back. Uh, Yannick, in this t tense meeting, and you mentioned you sure you're going to play Carlos more in the future. And uh, so what's your take on the rivalry between you and Carlos? Yeah, I feel like it's always, you know, great when when we meet. No, we try to push ourselves, you know, and and and, and each other to the limits. You know, we uh, him he for me is you know a point of where you know where where I work. You know, because also also today I saw a couple of things where where, where I need to get better, and you know it's 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 not only him. There are also a little bit other players, but. You know, it's always nice to share the court with him. Um, you know, I feel like also, also the fans they like it because you know usually the matches are quite long. They're physical. You know, there are many turning points. So, um, yeah, it's it's as I said, always nice and then, you know, feel privileged and honored to to share the court with him. And as I said, we both we try to we try to win. We try to concentrate on every point and and. You know, having a great attitude on the court that makes it happen. That that it's a very a very interesting match always. Question over here. Hi, Yannick. Hi. Have you noticed that you have uh, win ten ten times of your tie break uh, uh, until today? And uh, so, what, what do you think during today's tie break? So last one when you are three zero yeah ahead. Thank you. No, it can happen. Um, it was up 3-0. I, I served very good. It touched the net, the first ball. Um, you know, if I go there for 0 it's already a bit different. But, you know, it's it's unnecessary to talk about, you know, certain points. I felt like he he played great point also, you know, on 3-0 on, on, on and 3-1. Then he served very well on 3-2. On, on um, you know, the, the, the margins are very small. So, you know, but, but in... In the tie breaks, you know, the small margins, they seem very big. Um, and that's it, you know, it's, it's, you, you have to accept it, you have to, 
I have to keep working on, on a couple of things and I won many tie breaks in the last period of time. Um, this one, it, it, it went away, but, you know, there is, uh, that's it, no, it's, it's all good. Let's get one more uh, question in English, please. Yes, go ahead, sir. We've touched on this a little bit. Uh, this was the longest match in singles men's history at the China Open. Where does this rank among your matches that you've played in your entire career so far? Um, difficult to say because um, I feel like every match you play or important match you play, you, you, you live a different moment. So it's also very tough to give it a ranking, but for sure it's, it's, it's in the top, top three, top five. You know, it's it's you know, seven six in the third in the final. It it's always tough. Um, I had I had some great matches in the in the past. You know, even if I'm if I'm still young as a player. So, but yeah, it's it's I'm always happy to to make new experiences. You know, trying trying to grow and uh, yeah, sometimes you you win and sometimes you lose and and, and that's how the sport is. There are very highs and, and sometimes there are lows and. It's all good. My my season is going, you know, very very consistent, very great. We we try to keep building and and working for the rest of the season. Now in the next tournament, it's a very important tournament for me because I. It's only the second time I play there, but I I haven't reached the final stages of the tournament yet. So, you know, it's already trying to concentrate there and and hopefully finishing off the the season in a, in a very positive way.